Hello, uh, this is Rob Papen at the Frankfurt Music Messe here, presenting the new synthesizer Subboom Bass. It's dedicated to sub basses, deep basses, and uh, let's play a few sounds for you. Uh, shall I play it together with a groove? Okay, we have here the user interface with all the knobs. It's a classic build up synthesizer with two oscillators and um, you can go any direction. It is very good possible to use uh, Minimoog style basses using uh, the two oscillators and the high quality filters from uh, Subboom Bass. A classic Minimoog bass. So this is done with using two oscillators, the filter, and as you can see, maybe not on screen for you now, but it's totally dry. There are no effects used for this bass. So it's a very pure engine, very organic in sound. Um, what makes Subboom Bass special is that it can do any uh, very fat sounding Minimoog style bass, but also complete new textures. And with new textures, I mean that we have next to the uh, regular waveforms, like the saw waves, uh, um, the square waveforms, the saw waveforms, we have tuned percussion. And this tuned percussion is purely focusing on deep basses and uh, sub kicks which are uh, looped and um, for instance, uh, Udo, and Udo is a, is a kind of bottle. Yes, we have all kind of presets, basic presets, and of course, sub-bass presets, 128 presets. And uh, let me show you a few of the bases we have. For instance, this one is a uh, sub-bass, and it uses a buffalo. Buffalo is a big tom. And we use it as a bass, okay? I'll play a groove. So anything that goes deep, if you're in need of a deep bass sound, Subboom Bass has it. Even for, not urban music only, but you hear now more a bit more hip hop style. But for instance, if you do film score and you need a very deep drone, um, for instance, this sound is very good. It uses a contra bass, but totally edited with the synthesizer functions inside Subboom Bass. Okay, these are just the regular presets with all kind of new textures. But what this makes Subboom Bass very special is also the sequencer. It's not a regular 16-step sequence. It, it has the option for each step to have its own uh, wave selection. So basically, it's also wave sequencer. So each step can have its own um, wave. Okay, let me give you a few examples. There are many presets with the sequencer used. It also has the... Uh, the um, the unique feature from all the Rob Poppin synthesizers, the quick browser in which you can scroll through all the banks in one go without loading the bank. You just have a browser and you can uh, pick your preset. Well, this is the sequencer. So djembe, djembe playing. Uh, here we have the sequencer on board. Well, if we go more to the sequencer base now, or maybe it's better to play it solo. You hear only steps here. We have normally a free row, but next to it we have now inside the sequencer the option to select the oscillators and for each step to have a different waveform. Here you can see the list. You can pick one of the waveforms inside the uh, subboom base. There are also a lot of presets which are useful for club, any kind of modern music. Okay, I play it now solo without the drum loop. And you can really clearly hear the changes in the uh, sequencer. Sounds. Also, the, the, the 
special thing of it is that all the percussion instruments are tuned. So this groove is using a conga. But it plays also in the right key. Okay, solo. And the nicest thing is that you can combine these sample waveforms together with the regular waveforms. It's even possible inside the oscillator to pick a sample waveform and use the sub oscillator. And with the sub oscillator, you can find here we have even the option to go. If you go to the left, you have a sinus sub oscillator. If you go to the right, you have a square wave sub oscillator. So there are many synthesizer features on board. If you don't want to have deep editing things, you always can say, well, I don't like all these, uh, these knobs. You go to the easy mode, and the easy mode, you only have minimal controls, and still you have maximum impact. So here you can change the sounds, color frequency, still change the decays, It will be available at the end of April, and the uh, the list price is 99 euros. So it's a very very urban sounding, but very deep synth for anybody who seeks a deep uh, deep bass. Thank you.